at six in the morning. Actually, six forty-one. And I have been packing and getting stuff ready to move all night. Oh. All right, so I'm packing everything up. Most I thought you guys day. might like to see. This is most of what I have in my stash right now. Who says you can't have too many keyboards, right? And then of course I have my, still probably one of my very favorites I wanted to show you. This is from WASD Keyboards. This is a custom made WASD V2, I believe. And it is all custom printed keycaps, but the best part, I can get it out of here, holding this camera, is it's got the old Brain Bean logo, as well as my older kind of channel logo. which has changed now after I changed my name, but it's still super cool. Still one of my favorite things that I have that I've earned kind of from doing this. Uh, but yeah, that's the stash. Let me know in the comments too, if you guys want me to do like a detailed video, kind of letting you guys know what all this stuff is. I think that might be kind of fun just to kind of go through everything that I've accumulated over the year of doing this. And uh, also kind of why I keep each one. A lot of them I do giveaways for. Uh, and I'm also going to be doing at 10,000 subscribers yeah. uh, one giveaway every day for a week and a lot of that is going to be some of these items as well as some other stuff that's being uh, contributed to by other partners that I'm working with and things like that so there will be some new stuff as well as all this stuff that's new it's just been tested and reviewed uh, but yeah so that will be part of that but other than that guys I'm just going to keep on keeping at it I've got a lot of work to do so let's just get moving Too old for this. You guys want to see what cable management hell looks like? This is undoing all of my cable management. There's a lot of cables there to get organized and sorted. It's going to take a minute. Alright, well that took a lot longer than I wanted it to. I'm freaking exhausted, but the truck is loaded up. And I've got the PC nice and seat belted in there, so nothing happens to it. You can see back there, the whole office is loaded up back there, plus a whole bunch of other stuff. So now we're all going to go on the road to the new house. See you guys when we get there. It's about 10 o'clock at night. I've been moving all day, moving all the big stuff in the big truck. And it feels good to sit down, but I wanted to show you guys the new desk and kind of a little bit of the new setup as it's getting done. And uh, yeah, so <clears throat> this is the new desk. This is a set of Ikea Alex drawers and the eight foot uh, walnut countertop. Probably seen this before. A lot of big tech YouTubers and things have similar desks. It's just a really solid desk for a cheap price. Um, but the plan is, at least we're going to try it out and see how it goes, but my computer is going to go on one side, my wife's computer is going to go on the other because as much as I like all this desk real estate, I don't really think I need all of it probably do but we're gonna try it out we're gonna see how it goes see if we kind of compete for space too much and then we might explore other options but the, the plan is to take up as little of the office as possible so that we can turn kind of this whole other side into space to film because this office is probably a good three or four feet longer than my old office so I'll be able to have so much more room to film stuff so now I gotta figure out or at least get this countertop attached to these drawers and then I can start getting everything set up. So I'm gonna get to it. So 
Right now I'm just fastening these Alex drawers to this uh, Carl B walnut countertop. And I've got a set of brackets running along the back fastening into it and then I'm just uh, screwing in the drawers directly into the countertop. So I've already drilled some pilot holes and now I'm just going to be screwing it in. I'm just working on putting up some lights up here that'll sit behind the desk and that way when I'm doing streams I can be better illuminated without having to have like a big bunch of soft boxes around me or uh, having a dim lit version of me or if I start to do green screen or stuff like that having these two lights mounted to the wall that will shine up and illuminate me is going to help a lot so going to be hooking those up and then putting the studio foam up on the wall and the office will pretty much be ready. I've got the desk done now. I've got the lighting strips installed behind it. The cable management is mostly done. And I'll show you guys that here in just a little bit. But for now, I'm going to get going on this wall here. Well, that's it for the moving blog guys. I know I didn't include everything that I could and the whole process has just been really exhausting and to be honest it's just really hard to film everything and still get stuff done. So I had to cut a little bit out of there uh, and be a little bit lazy with it as far as what I was able to film. But now that the office is pretty much finished being set up I've got some final touches to do but you can expect regular videos to start rolling out from me probably in the next week or so and get back to my regular reviews and stuff like that. Thanks for sticking with me. I've been trying to get content out there for you guys uh, with things like this moving vlog and with my uh, Luke Gaming unboxing last week. Uh, but I know you guys still want to get back to the tech and that kind of stuff, so I will have that coming for you very soon. Thank you for sticking with me through this whole process, and I can't wait to see you guys very soon with some more tech reviews.